Okay, so I recorded this video last week and it did not work out because I just didn't like how it looked because I used stickers and stuff. So this week I'm going to do it my typical way without stickers. Um, I start off, if you saw my Instagram post, you know, I kind of cover up this side. So I start off with drawing these lines and that's just to separate how I do my days. And so I try to draw the lines and then let them dry. The pen I used was this Pilot G2 7.07, um, 07. <laughs> Well, this bigger pen so it like smudges so even though I did let it lay and dry it's still smudged um, I put a piece of washi down the side to cover the dates I brought different ones this week I'll show you my previous weeks um, so this was one week and this was last week and I just didn't like that I used the stickers but I incorporated some other washi in there and I love this washi it's almost gone <laughs> I love it so much but and then some little bows and little number stickers but I didn't really like using stickers for the days of the week because I just I just don't like how it looks <laughs> so I'm I think I'm gonna take the yellow I think I'll do the yellow it's kind of neutral-ish and Put that down the side. And I mean, all I really, you can actually see through this. So this may not be the one that works. Let me see if you can see through the other ones. As good as you can see through the yellow. Can you? You actually can. This is not the best washi to use, so don't use washi like this. So let me see what else I have right with me because I don't feel like I'm going upstairs to grab any more washi tape. This is thicker, but um, it might work. If you hear a noise in the background, my daughter is terrorizing the house. So this is not quite the look I want, but it's whatever. I did not come prepared with the card to use, so I'm going to use my New York and Company card. <laughs> okay. So that is going to work. Again, I typically like a skinnier washi, but... I'm not mad at it. Um, you can kind of see the dates or whatever, but I mean, you really have to be looking for them. I just want to straighten that up some. Okay. So and that is what it is this week. Okay. I've been using a lot of blue lately in my planner and I'm kind of over it. So I'm going to use pink, a pink mild liner this week. And... I'm trying to think of the best place. I might just put it on this side. It's the most simple place for the date, and that is not a straight line. I am fully aware. And then I'm just gonna continue. Um, there's nothing super like fancy about this, clearly. Um, it's just simple, and I like how that looks in this type of planner. So I'm going to go in with my pen and I'm going to start writing. So Monday is the 10th. Today is actually Monday when I'm recording this. I am getting a late start. So it's Monday, Tuesday. hope y'all could see all of that stuff I was just doing I'm really not even sure um okay so that is how it looks right now um I wrote it in cursive to you know distinguish it from what I'm actually writing that I'm doing on that day for me this works out a lot better because it gives me so much space per day and I can use both pages sometimes I don't put anything over here like I have 
so many weeks where I just left this blank because I just didn't have the time. So this layout works better for me in the weeks. So I kind of have been planning. This is the planner that I take with me. It's not this planner yet. This is a July start planner, the happy planner, wrong, wrong. Um, and it has the dashboard layout. But right now I'm just using old inserts in it, the horizontal layout. So some of the information is confidential because I use it for work. So I'm just gonna go through, pick out the things that I have to do and add them here. Okay, so this is what I've added so far. Um, I'm, I have to go back and write more specific details, but again, um, some of it's just private because I'm a social worker. So a lot of my meetings and stuff um, involve kids. So I clearly can't put their information on YouTube, but I just put like, I have um, my timesheets are due on Mondays for my job. Um, I have home visits, case notes, schedule meetings. And then here I put my Hobo Weeks video, which is this right here. Um, other visits, I have a meeting. This sticker came out of the Happy Planner um, Boss Babe sticker book. Uh, I had a coffee today. It was Dunkin', not Starbucks, because Dunkin' has food, but I like to note when I have coffee because coffee affects like my stomach. Coffee makes me super bloated. Um, but I like to know, you know, when I've had coffee. Also, the way my budget is <laughs> set up, I like to make sure that I'm not spending a lot of money on coffee because that's one of the things that I wanted to focus on um, in this year was just um, spending my money a little better. So um, I kind of am the type of person that plans as I go because I use my planner for not only keeping up with meetings and things that are coming up, but also with my job, I have to go in at the end of the week and just kind of write down what I did every day of the week. So as I do more things, like this started off with just um, three things and I kind of added more stuff. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, so you're gonna hear my daughter in the background because I had to pick her up early today. But like I said, I think, I don't know where I really stopped, but I have to enter in what I do throughout the day. So like tomorrow is Tuesday. So um, I will be entering, you know, so I have these two things down, but whatever else I do, I'll just fill it in so that at the end of the week, when I go back and I have to fill out that sheet that says what I did every day, it's already there. So that's a, another reason that I needed more space. So yeah, so I'm gonna go in now and finish putting everything down and I'll be back. Okay, so this is what I have. I added the rest of my stickers. I have a birthday party to go to on this day, so I added this cute little sticker from... from this little sticker kit that I got from Hobby Lobby, and I think it's adorable because I love little um, anime Harajuku. I don't know, I don't know the actual name, but I like these little um, characters because this is kind of like what I used to draw when I was in high school. Like, all of my pictures look like this, so love it and i love that they have brown girls so that makes me happy so this is pretty much all i have again it'll be filled in more at the end of the week but i love it i love this layout i like for this side and the sides to kind of be you know compatible so i typically take whatever washi i put over here and try to put some on this side that is my finishing touch and that's pretty much what my week looks like in my Hobonichi weeks. Thank you so much for watching, y'all. Um, I hope this video was enjoyable. If you have any videos that you want to see, again, I do have other planners. Like, I have this planner, but I really don't decorate or anything in this planner. Because happy planners are so colorful and stuff anyway. It kind of... I'm not sure how to really decorate in them, so I don't do too much decorating. I love, like, plain pages, which is a reason that I do use my Stology and stuff like that. I love plain pages that I can do whatever in. So, that is it. Again, thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that button down below and subscribe, okay? Thank you. Bye, y'all.